we have animals today. We are looking at a nice series that's coming out, that's developing, that's starting out. I think a lot of potential. So let's get right into these and look at them. I'm going to try to keep this video nice and short and sweet. We have the World's Wildlife Series, is what it's called. Number one is the giraffe on the left. Number two so far out is the whale on the right, obviously. And we have, again, good subject matter, good theme. I don't think this will ever get old. But, I mean, there's so many variables out there, too. There's so many different ways to, to tackle that theme, that subject matter. And I think that these have been done in, in a great manner, in a great way. Let's start with the giraffe, as it, as it was number one. Uh, well, let's start with the back. We have the government of Congo there, the Republic of Congo. Uh, no, Republic Democratic of Congo. I'm not French, so you'll have to forgive me there. Sorry. We have Congo. In the very center, you have the head of a leopard. I thought at first it was a lion or, a, or I'm not a lion, I'm a tiger, but it's definitely a leopard. A tusk on the left, we have a spear to the right. Then we have the words justice, peace, and labor translated. 2020, uh, 2020, yeah, I'm getting ahead of myself. 2019 is the year. You have one ounce AG9999, so you have the four nines, purity for the silver, and then 20 francs as the denomination for the coin. Um, it does have a mirrored finish, but please don't think that it's proof because it's not. It's definitely bullion, bullion condition. Um, so the 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 uh, uh, the glossy, the mirrored finish just gives it a nice touch, uh, but it is definitely a bullion coin. You do have a border all the way around the coin on on the back here on the reverse. I think it's the reverse, um, and so you have nice little features there, as far as the back goes. So it does have some something going for it. Even in the back, like I said, I, I'd like I like coins that have something that that tell you something on the on the on the back side as well as the front. So flipping it to the front, the giraffe. So we have the mighty, tall, very tall giraffe. Uh, so it's portrayed here as running in the savanna desert. Is that a desert? The savanna. It's not a desert. The savanna is what I should say in Africa. The giraffe written to you in the very top. You've got clouds in the skies as in, in the uh, background there in, in the large field. Uh, again, the, the giraffe that's portrayed as running. You have some trees. I'm gonna, let me try to zoom in a little bit. It's difficult because I always lose my focus when I zoom in. All right, so you can see brushes and trees in the background there. And of course, at the very bottom, you have the world's wildlife and in the very center of the globe. So there you have it. This is the very first in the series. The mintage of each of the coins will be 30,000. So it is rather low uh, for the series, for creating a series. And, and I guess that will keep the collectability a bit higher. Is that, is that the right way to say it? The demand, the collectability, a little higher. So all overall, it is an attractive design, good artwork um, for the very first one that they came out with. Jumping to number two of the series. Now the back again will be exactly the same, of course. Um, the only difference will be the 2020 as far as the date instead of 2019. But everything else, um, as far as I can see anyway, is exactly the same. So right to the front of the coin, the obverse. From the top again is the whale. And then coming down you have um, the sky again with a few clouds. That's the seems to be the motif so far. And then you have uh, the whale um, shooting out of the water, uh, getting ready to do a nice re-entry with a big splash, because we don't see that part. But I guess this is the most common design that you'll see, the common pose that you will see on whales. That's pretty, pretty common, I guess, as far as that goes. But they do give you some good detail here. If I can zoom in again without losing the focus. Uh, you can see the water splashing, the water dripping down from the whale. That's a nice touch, even on the wing, on the um, yeah, on the wing, <laughs> um, from the top there. So th it is a a very nice depiction of this whale coming out of the water. And again, keep coming down. You have the ocean there, of course, and then at the very bottom, world's wildlife, 
and in the center you've got the globe. Um, of course, I, I'm, just to point out, the globe is different here. So if we look at the, the first one, we had the African continent for the giraffe. And then on the second one, we have uh, the center is the ocean on this one. So I'm assuming that the next one, depending on where uh, the animal is from, uh, we'll have a difference there too. And it makes it nice too, because each coin, um, it does show a little bit more effort being made, instead of everything being exactly the same, um, besides the actual artwork. So that's nice. That's a nice touch, I think. It makes it stand out a bit more. It makes it more collectible, in my opinion. There you are. Keeping it nice and short. What do you guys think? Um, I don't think I've missed anything on this. Um, mintage on this also is 30,000. So we're good there. So this is number two. As I said before, giraffe was number one. Looking forward to number three. And of course, we'll do a video when that one comes out. And uh, there you are. What do you guys think? Again, the mirrored finish. I do like that. But remember, it is a bullion coin. Um, they're pretty much in bullion condition, not proof or proof-like or brilliant uncirculated. It's definitely bullion. But there you have it. Thoughts? What do you think? Give me a comment down there. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. I do try to bring videos um, as soon, uh, when I can, time permitting. Uh, sometimes I'll have two, three videos come out in a week, and sometimes just one every in two weeks. But I do try my best. Life, you know, it gets in the way sometimes. But there you have it. Comments, please do leave me a comment. Share the video if you would. Like it. Uh, subscribe. And after you've subscribed, there's a bell down there. Make sure you hit the bell. That way you'll be updated when um, I do put out another video. Appreciate your time. Appreciate you staying with me and watching the video. Have a great rest of the day or evening, wherever you might be, wherever you're doing. And we will catch you on the next one. Bye-bye. <music>